Good afternoon. Good afternoon, beautiful people. Blessed day. Blessed day. We got another day here on God's green earth. And that is a, that itself. It really is enough to, to just give praise and glory to him. 125, 1,048%, you know. Um, I wanted to do a quick video here. I got to find it. Um, a buddy of mine had me in Proverbs. And I was just reading chapter after chapter because uh, it was it was really just kind of it was really just sticking out to me. Uh, now I'm in Job myself. Um, when you going through hard times, get in the book of Job. Get in the book of Job and and actually not Job but Job and actually see um, and actually see what true hardship is. You know, you think you're going through it? You think you lost something? <laughs> you think you hurt? <laughs> Get in the book of Job, you know, then you'll see that, you know, what you're going through is just a season. And that's exactly what it is. It's just a season. Um, what you're going through, and apparently Proverbs does not want to pop. There we go. Ah, ah, finally found it. Sorry, this, 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 this new book right here. This, this new mini Bible right here. Uh, let's start Psalms. What in the ham sandwich? Psalms. Psalms. Oh, there we go. Okay. Now I'm back in Proverbs. Sorry, man. Okay. So, if you don't know yet, this is the Bible that I'm reading from. King James Version. Go to the dollar store and pick one up. But you got to get your word. You got to feed your spirit every day. So, uh, today's reading comes from Proverbs chapter 3, verse 31 to 35. And it, and it reads, envy thou not the oppressor and choose none of his ways for the for for the fro. Oh God, that's a typo for the forward is abomination to the Lord, but his secret is with the righteous. And I want to stop right there with those two verses right there. I'm going to read to 35, but I want to stop right there. At verse 31 and 32. Envy not envy thou not the oppressor. Envy not the enemy and choose none of his ways because his ways are wicked. His ways will corrupt you if you choose to go his way, if you choose to do his way, if you choose to walk in his, um, you know, his perversions, if you choose to walk in his sin, it's, it's going to lead to destruction, your destruction. For the forward, forward is abomination to the Lord, but his secret is with the righteousness. You want God to talk to you? Right there, the ways of the oppressor is saying the ways of the oppressor is an abomination to the Lord. But the Lord's secret is with the righteous. Because the Lord can trust a man that knows how to keep his mouth closed. If if man can and, and God and God will let you know that. He'll he'll send people to you that'll talk to you, tell you things, let you know what's going on and He'll he'll send you. He'll start sending you people when he when he's preparing you to put you in, in certain positions, and he wants to know if he can if if he can trust you with his secrets, if he can talk to you. Are you going to be quiet? You know, are you going to be quiet with my secrets when I tell you? Are you going to go go and tell the enemy all my secrets? So verse thirty three: the curse of the Lord is in the house of the wicked. Amen. But he blesseth the habitation of the just. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Mm. So the house of the wicked is cursed by the Lord. But the house of the just is blessed. Man. I almost got tears coming my eyes on that one. Surely he scorneth the scorners, but he giveth grace unto the lowly. You know, um, he is close to the weak at heart and um, he is close to those broken hearted. You know, he, he, he's with those people that, that are at their low point. So he's close to the lowly and he gives them his grace. But those who scorn the lowly, 
those who throw fire at the lonely, lowly, those who talk about them and do all types of things to them. He scorns them. He scorns them because they know better. Verse 35, the wise shall inherit. Oh God, hallelujah. Hallelujah. The wise shall inherit glory, but shame shall be the promotion of fools. Wow. And I remember I was a fool. I used to be a fool. You know, I used to be a fool. Like, you know, I, it, 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 I, I used to be a fool where I, you know, somebody hurt me. I'd be like, oh, I, I got to do this to hurt you. I got to do this to shame you. Like, I, I used to be that fool. That's why, like, people that have done me wrong now, I just look at them and say, I say, I love you. I love you because like, God wants to give you the biggest hug he can, man. You know, I love you. I love you. And and, and that's God. That's God telling me I love you. People that have done me wrong, like when, when I when I talk to them and you know, I always ask God, like, work through me, God, talk through me, God. Like, what do you want this person to know? And like, you know, like with my spouse, that's the that's the only thing I that's the only thing God will ever allow me to say too. Because there's a lot that I want to say. There's a lot my flesh wanna say about, about, about you know, about everything, about a lot of stuff. But God will only allow I love you to come out. That's it. He only he will only allow I love you to come out. You know, sometimes he'll let me he'll allow me to break down and, and, and let my heart out, but not without saying I love you. But that's the that's the reading for the day right here, man. Proverbs thirty one to thirty five. Um I know I read my chapter today in Proverbs and uh chapter in Job. Um so yeah, that is it, man. You guys have a very blessed day. I pray the blood of Jesus over you guys. Over um, over Elaine Gross, over my children, Kevin, Michael, and Aaliyah. I pray that it protects all of us, me included, from the spiritual wickedness, evil principalities in the world unseen. And I pray that you guys continue to stay blessed throughout this pandemic. In Jesus' holy name, we pray. Amen, amen, amen. Thank you guys for tuning in today, man. You guys have a blessed man. Stay with God. Stay in your book. Stay with the word. Keep feeding that spirit, man. Take care.